Hey, what's up everybody? It's Zane Hadzik, team athlete with Nutribile, and I'm gonna talk to you about at-home workouts today and do a full body workout for you to check out. Um, for all the details on it, be sure to check out Nutribile's blog. We have the full workout there and some good reasons why you should consider doing a full body workout at home. And um, with all these exercises, we're gonna be doing three sets. I want you to go pretty close to failure and I'll do a demo of each. Okay, so our first exercise is going to be a prisoner squat. So if you have dumbbells, use them if you need them. If not, you could use your body weight. You'll just have to do more reps. If you have a dumbbell or something heavy, you hold it in front of you. And we're just going to do our standard squat. Our second exercise for the first workout is going to be calf raises. Simple. If you have stairs and you want to stand on the edge of the stairs to get an extra stretch, you can, but it's not necessary. And if that's too easy, you can hold weight or you could do one leg at a time. Makes it more challenging as well. So our third exercise for the first workout is going to be your standard push-up. Get down, do your push-ups, nice slow and controlled form. Go until you can't go anymore. And then what I want you to do is drop down to your knees and then just keep on going. And really go until you can't go anymore to fully fatigue the chest. So our fourth exercise on our first day is going to be a standard shoulder press. With dumbbells, I'm gonna demonstrate. If you have a resistance band, or if you don't have weight, um, find something heavier in your house. A suitcase, you could use two hands, or two water jugs, perhaps, filled up. So our fifth exercise is going to be the body row, and I'm sitting on the floor because you need a table for this one. You slide under it, you grab it on its sides, you get a nice strong flat back, tighten your core, and then pull your body up as high as you can. Our sixth exercise is going to be the dumbbell curl. So you're probably familiar with this one. If you have dumbbells, we're just going to simply Curl the weight. You don't, uh, you don't need a gym for this one. And if you don't have dumbbells, you can find something heavy at your house. For example, a gallon of water would work pretty well. Um, that's what I would suggest. Our next exercise is gonna be the triceps dip. Um, all you need is a chair for this. You want your elbows tucked nice and tight toward your body. You wanna keep your back toward the chair. Go all the way down, all the way up. Focus on full range of motion really squeeze the top. Our final exercise is going to be either an ab roller or if you don't have the ab roller, a standard crunch. So first with the ab roller, get down on our knees, tighten our core, and extend all the way out. If you don't have the ab roller, Hand behind your head. Make sure your lower back is pushed against the floor. Engage your abs. And do a crunch. 